All right, one day left. Fingers crossed. All <laughs> indications point to the Badgers and Sun Devils actually playing that game in Las Vegas despite COVID canceling many other bowl games. Today, tight end Jake Ferguson said the pandemic taught him one key thing. Learn to appreciate every game you get. That's now, Lane, pretty wise. Yeah, it is. And Lane Kimball live in Las Vegas tonight where the team spoke with reporters one final time before tomorrow night's game. Lane? Well, guys, just how important is the Las Vegas Bowl to Paul Christ? According to the coach, very. It's both a chance for his seniors to get one final win, but also a chance for some younger players to gain some invaluable experience. With the tangible prize standing in front of him, Badgers coach Paul Chris spoke a lot about the intangibles of what this week means. Grateful for one, one more opportunity, last opportunity for uh, this team to be able to play. While the Las Vegas Bowl wasn't the preseason goal, tight end Jake Ferguson knows Thursday's game against Arizona State uh, is important. I mean, it's always good to get one in the W column, um, but I think finishing this one off, uh, ending this season with this team, uh, this is a special team, gone through a lot of adversity. Adversity that includes dealing with COVID, something that's keeping starting fullback John Chanel and some other players home. I've loved and appreciated the way the guys have uh, approached everything and certainly, we're aware of it, and, and you know, we've had some some players um, that are not on the trip because of it, but um, you just kind of roll with it. Arizona State is rolling with the punches, too, heading into a game against Wisconsin without it starting running backs and corners. We just prepare for the opponent, uh, and we're playing a very good opponent. Uh, they've been very consistent all season. That's thanks in large part to star tailback Braylon Allen, who's piled up 1,100 yards and 12 touchdowns, essentially in eight games. The game's going to be one up front, so it's, it's about who wants it more. Do they want it more than us, or do we want it more than them? On a sun-soaked bowl game eve, there's still a full day to contemplate that before the Sun Devils and the favored Badgers enter Allegiant Stadium for the first time. We've had the opportunity to play at some Stadium similar and things like that, and you know it's always exciting to go, to go see them all and to kind of play in the NFL stadiums because obviously that's a lot of people's goals. Badgers will get a chance to walk through Allegiant Stadium for the very first time tomorrow morning, about eight hours before kickoff. And speaking of that stadium, someone who knows an awful lot about playing inside of there has some pointers for his former team. We will hear from him tonight at 6 o'clock. For now, covering the Badgers live in Las Vegas, Lane Kimball, News 3 Now. And look at Lane with the gloves on. He didn't <laughs> know. know it was going to be this cold in Vegas. It's going to be chilly for those Sun Devils. The Badgers will be ready for it. Lane, thank you. Jump around at the pep rally. That'll warm you up.